That's what I do. Smoking. Hmm, out there. Uh oh. Fighting starts for us in ten seconds. I pressed the wrong button. I pressed E instead of Q and charged into the gate. It's been a long time since I played Blaze. My pleasure, thank you. So long as that spooky guy is here, I just need to clear fast. Because he's going to beat me in lane anyway. Thank you very much, uh, Brunader. Doesn't want me to have it. Nice performance on WC3 tournament. They definitely had it in for you on the team matches, D. Yeah. Well, thank you, man. Thank you very much, uh, Haas. Yeah, the FFA was pretty wrecked. Dylan doesn't look like I can beat uh, beat him at all. So I needed my four man to win, or maybe to split off and do a uh, two versus or something. Oh, that just looks like bad news. too bad they did very little siege damage in fact they have almost no siege damage uh, any chance we can get some camps after the dust settles they wouldn't be able to clear siege easily would it be better if hanzo's top Maybe it's better if Hanzo versus Malthea yeah. and me in the format, or not. It's not a lot of conversation here. Conversation has run dry. That's what's going on. 
Alright, let's just do a five man first of all. Oh, it was a four. I thought it was five. At least I got a whole bunch of stacks. I thought we were still five, like momentary five before, then swap. Maybe they don't want to join voice. Just it kind of invalidates the voice such as we have it. I don't want to pressure them, just asking. It feels weird not to ask just because I'm scared that they'll say no. It's like prom. Hello. Oh, hi. Cool, thanks. This looks like a more healthy setup. Hanzo is better against uh, uh, Malfeo. And uh, I provide the tanking support that uh, Tyrael doesn't have. Top. Okay. That's the good stuff. The incoming Zerg rush is technically smaller two, two than the one enemy, but it's still an incoming Zerg rush. I'm not sure. I'm coming top. I'm dead. But Sorry. It's okay. On the 1v3. <laughs> First I was on fire, but now I'm fired. Uh, Kainveg Raus says, Hey Grubby, I need your opinion. Battlefield of Eternity. If our team is better at team fighting, but the other team is better at immortal race, should we defend our immortal? Oh, hold on. Nice. Hold on, hold on. Okay. Should we defend our immortal, try to reduce the shield as much as possible, and seek plays elsewhere? My team is split. Uh, you should continually fight and defend your own immortal while soaking uh, superior experience. Always group up more than the other team and yeah, defend. Don't just go for the shield. Like, you'll lose the whole game that way. If, you, if shield trade is your strategy, you'll always lose. Attack speed is not relevant. Suppressor fire is good, but I'll get the fuel leak. Okay, you. Well, 
Wow, they used everything though. It's pretty insane. After we switch lanes, it's been such an easy game. That's true. Except, of course, for my two deaths. But that was a such so much better split. Hanzo versus Mouth is it's good. I guess I'm uh, gonna be solo for a bit more. I've made some pretty poor, like uh, I mean, you know, there's some bit some bad moments buying for me. There's also been some good ones. Greetings, friend. Loved seeing you playing WC3 again. Missed you, you at the Western Ah, uh, not yet. I would have loved to see your analysis after that epic final game. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, it was a great time. Perfect. Yeah, we probably need to swap. Okay, I'm moving. I'm still top. Okay, man. Welcome. Ah, uh, do we go or could be risky? What is your most favorite map in Hots? Because I personally love Battlefield of Eternity 3. Oops. That corpse makes for good games. Ladies and gentlemen, start your engines. Uh, yeah, uh, I like uh, Infernal Shrines a lot. Love it very much. But uh, I like Battlefield of Eternity as well, Lady Savannah's Windrunner. But I always think of Infernal Shrines as one of my favorites. Cur Cursed nice. Infernal. Coming bot. Oh dear. Here come a Zerg. Fewer than the enemies, or whatever that's worth. Blood and thunder. It's about their time. Good stuff. Good stuff. Uh, end bolt. Love your streams, my dude. Keep up the hard work, smiley face. Uh, sorry for all the keys, I thought I offed my mic. Did you well played? Sometimes I don't off my mic and my allies hear all this uh, stuff. <laughs> Mint Carp, love your streams, my dude. Keep up the hard work. Thank you very much for the two months up, and you too, Eruvium. Uh, honest question, what's the point of jumping in and out of the bunker so quickly? So, you can jump in and out in like less than half a second. But the cooldown of the flamethrower is normally like, I don't know, two seconds. So normally you get like flamethrower every two seconds. But it resets when you get in. So, you could flamethrower like three times as fast. I didn't do the maths exactly. 
But it's something like that. Greetings, friend. Less than three. Remember when Grubby talked about to his team about peanut butter and jelly? <laughs> I remember that. I remember that. Greetings, friend. Uh, cool. 